All right, everyone. Uh, we just finished travel in Soko, this massive custom world with a lot of stuff, and we're going to be playing Extrude now. So this is all about one by one blocks. So Extrude is something where you can push against the wall to extrude the block off the wall. We got same here. Another block in sequence. We got these. Hmm. Are we going to make this work? These are already on their proper targets, but I guess this one is not. So we got to do something about these blocks without getting them away. Hmm. So if we get any blocks stuck at the back, it's a bad idea. We can do that. I don't know about getting the other one out, though. It looks like we do need to do that. But how? Okay, uh, I already have no idea what to do here. <laughs> I'm just moving it down one. What the heck? How do you do it? Hold on. Um, you can extrude blocks. No, you can't. I thought we could extrude blocks through. Um, even if they were in there, but I guess maybe I'm misremembering. Like... Okay, that looks way better than what well, than what just happened before. Probably will need to move this down though. No. Hmm. What do I do here? We need to go here. Hmm. Well, I mean that would make this work. Don't know about the other stuff though. Yeah. Wait, I can just like enter this way. Nice. Um. What about that one though? Hmm. Okay, looks like we got everything good. Okay, this seem this seems good. Yes, 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 let's go. Okay. Need to do five more in this section just to get to the next area or whatever. It's kind of weird. Um, but but I'm gonna one hundred percent everything because that's what I do. Okay, these opening moves are four, so that must go in there. But we gotta extrude that off or something, right? Yeah, like that. Like, what a what a freaking move. It's like we enter the green by that extrusion, so pretty cursed stuff. Um, that level looks almost the same, but it's in the other way. Freaking extrude corner cases, of course. We, no, we can't. We still can't do it. Hmm. Maybe an eat? Nope. We want to get out of here, but that's not going to work. That's forced. Hmm, okay, but we can use the corner case to switch it around. Hmm. Didn't do anything. Okay, good. Kind of? Now the green is there, but we don't want the green. We want the green out. Yes, good. Good. Another one in this sequence? Oh, I might have actually like legit played this in Hub, although the geometry looks a little different still. So, I'm in that room, I extrude out, I and mean, that extrude seems relatively normal, considering how things are. Well, that didn't work. Other way? Maybe? Nope. Hmm. Where else can this go? Because I'm stuck here. I literally only know how to push that left. What the heck? What even? No, it's because it was correct already, I see. I see. I didn't need to do anything else special with the block. Um, okay. So actually, it's kind of a normal level. Anyway. Let's continue. That's, uh, it's an Epsilon Paradox, what happens when, um, you get two of the same block near a wall like that. Um, so that's the clone, this is the regular, so if we guys are the clone things that go into it, just go into the regular block. That's a weird block down below, though. I think I want to get to it, I just don't know how exactly. Hmm. Well, it's not the clone that gets stuck there, it's the real that gets stuck, because we can get it out through extrusion. But... Okay, this looks like it's pretty good. Okay, there we go, we win. And another one. We only need to get these two. I can enter this or something. Is it really good to do that? We're stuck here. 
Hmm, that wasn't very good, was it? That's a cycle. Huh. So the moves I make there are kind of forced. How the, how do I even get out of there? That's nuts. Great. Great extrusion. Not. Wait, can I cause the extrusion from afar using this? I think that was just it. Look at that. That's an extrusion using a cycle. And I can extrude. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. Extrusions from afar. That needs to not be there. Oh, we can just do that. We, didn't, we just need empty rooms. Okay. So, that's complete, but I'm doing the four extras because I'm not skipping anything. This looks very similar. Is the cycle, like, worse this time or what? Maybe I need, like, a buffer block? Move that there. Okay, now it's out. Don't want that block in there. Okay, getting the clone there stuck. It looks like a bad idea. Hmm. That buffer didn't help very much. It'd be nice to not have the clone in the way here. Can I do this and... Dang it. I didn't push anything out. Hmm. Let's enter this to move the clone to the side. Then we can push that block out. That's good. We win immediately. Okay. Let's open. Right side is open and the void is can contain three blocks. I don't think we're going to put anything in the void though. So this can contain itself. Um, there's a thing underneath these, right? It's just we need to get that. Feels like it's another cycle thing, honestly, but I'm not sure. Like, that extrusion is a little suspicious, but don't know how to interpret. Uh, so that's another, that's an Infinity Paradox in a different void. I just want to, like, cycle, right? But this is just weird. It really feels like another one of those cycling tricks. It didn't work. Maybe we can extrude out to make it work? No, I can't. Not here. Hmm. Let's move that to move it here, and then here maybe? There, there it is. I knew it. Cycle, block, that was definitely gonna happen. Um, luckily that wasn't too complicated. Anyway, now we are a room containing a player target in it. Um, so we need to do something. That, that was forced, I think. All these are forced, and here's another possessable block. Um, we can extrude that in some sort of weird way. That's not possessing it, though. I'm guessing that's because of the way that's inside a room that prevents me from possessing it like I wanted to. Here, like, it's freaking blocked and I can't access it. Probably because, like, the, the true room it counts as, like, the brown or something. Anyway, what do we do here? Extrude. Lots of open area there as well. I kind of want that to have the, whatever the block, look at that, that is nice, isn't it? You can see, like, just from some of the bits poking out with the brown, got successfully extruded here. Um, okay. Now I wonder if I can possess? Hmm, still seems a little difficult to do so. Uh, that is a, that is a really cursed move. And I still don't know how I'm going to get into it. Maybe switch them around, you know? No, not even switching them around works. First, first, first. Um. Wait, we need a blocker, right? That's how things have traditionally worked. We needed stuff to get blocked. Um, the problem is, like, that zone is here. And I'm also not sure how that zone is especially better. Because it's in a similar view to just the vertical of this area. I want to control that block. Is it just like... I already got the blocks out, so that's a good thing. No. Get that out of here. So switch, I switched the order of that, but maybe that's not good enough because it's hard to fit anything in here. 
The alternative, though, is putting a block, which is not that great. I don't know what to do. Okay, I finally got it. It's like... I needed that brown um, as the front, because, like, previously it didn't work, so I had to reverse it. And this move works. Um, look in here. The order is, like... It contains an empty room, and eating isn't happening. Don't ask me why. Honestly, it's difficult for me to appreciate the kind of intuition that makes this work. I'm going to assume that's something about how extrusion causes a push against yourself, um, and like regular pushing or something does not work. It's just odd because you can enter it from here, obviously, but apparently you can't enter from this side. Um, and like, of course, if you do this, it just enters as you would expect. So it's like something about having that freaking block there. Um, is, is why you can't anyway. Um, I guess the finish is right there. So there we are. Um, that's an Epsilon. So we get Epsilon by getting into the smallest, um, in, infinitesimally small space. Unfortunately, that is Infinity because, well, Infinity does not have a board at the bottom. Oh, yes, it does, but we don't have it. Um, so yeah, infinity will happen if we put the real inside the clone. We don't want that. We also need that box to be safe. Hmm. We get that box sort of out of here. Freaking extrusion. Anyway, this will also cause an infinity issue, so don't do that. This will cause cycles. I don't know. That clump being in the corner isn't good, so let's not. You can, you can do some odd cycling here. Lol. Okay, that doesn't look very good. Let's... Hmm. But, huh. Nope, that's not good. You don't want that like this. It's technically not stuck. But we do want this block not to be here, though. And... Hmm. Wow, it's really easy to get stuff stuck in corners that you don't want. That's bad because it gets the stuff stuck. Hmm. So I can, do, I can do some... Hold on. Did that save the block? No, I can't move this very well at all. If I do this, the clone gets stuck in the corner, which is not good. I Hold on. Isn't this good? No, it's not. I was thinking of moving this out. Well, maybe we can still salvage it. No, we don't have the clone in there. We need the clone to go in the reel. So anything that prevents that is going to suck. I, I only have that in the middle so that I can like later hopefully get rid of it. But that doesn't eat out, though. Bad. And I wish this block went up or something, but it doesn't. Also, like, I need this block. It, it can't, like, just throw it in a corner and be like, oh, yep, done. I don't know if I stick that there. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Looks bad, though. Nice infinity. Again, I can't have that. Oh! Of course, something like this would happen. Look at this. I was, like, testing that it felt suspicious that Extrude like, was here and stuff. That move does not act like a, your traditional enter. Like, this is a failure, but I, I don't remember this was a thing. I really don't, like... What? But yeah, if you do that, the freaking thing goes underneath you... And, like, it actually freaking works for Epsilon now. Um, funny that the Epsilon block itself can be moved, but anyway, that is, um, supremely cursed. You don't even need the block for it, so, um, see you in Epsilon, I guess? Okay. Freaking extrude. Freaking extrude. Okay, so... That finished block is very tempting, but I'm not doing that. Well, well, maybe it's going to create a long credits that will ruin my click-through rate next video. 
But maybe a new section will come. Okay, I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> okay. This world was so cool and so big. Um, I do wonder if there's more after this, as there was in regular par uh, Parabox. And now we get to see everything. Oh my gosh. Freaking Infinite Exodus Enter. And having some worlds that impersonate Parabox main game worlds. I really enjoyed this. Um, like, a lot of freaking ground was covered even with just one by one blocks. And then there's like the unique ones like Fast, my favorite one, Remote. Again, I kind of wish there were some more unique color schemes used. Travel had that most unique one, but Stack is obviously copying from Eat and X is from uh, Empty. It's funny that people are obviously able to get um, correctly matching uh, color schemes, but here we are. Yeah, okay. So, if you're wondering what the heck was up with that hole at the top, it's, this is regular Parabox. This is regular Parabox, fool. Okay. Okay, so what has changed? Yeah, okay. That hole doesn't make any sense. Like, it's just the void. It just, I, anyway, it doesn't even loop around, but... So... This is the new unlock? It's real special. Stack plus? Clones have got nothing. Um... What's this? Remote plus. Jeez. So, like, there's bonus challenges. Hungry. Okay, well, guess that's what we're doing next. Uh, all these challenge worlds. But they're in the main game and weren't visible before. Uh, there's two challenge worlds for this one? What? That's plus plus. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, goodbye. <laughs>